Hi, I'm Antoinette. I'm a first year BA Philosophy and Classical Civilization joint honours student at the University of Nottingham. And this is going to be my first student life vlog. Yay! This is just going to be a quick review of everything that's happened in the autumn semester. And now I'm finally home over Christmas. This is me sitting down and taking a breather and just being like, right, so what actually happened for the past three months? University itself, when I first got there back in August, bright eyed and bushy tailed, I don't know what I was expecting because everyone is like, uni is great, you have so much freedom, you know, you can do whatever you want. And then suddenly I was like, uni has so much freedom, I can do whatever I want. Because usually at school, I remember that everyone was like, right, all you need to do is hand in this form by this deadline and then it will be fine. Whereas at university, you have to make sure that you're registered with a health center yourself. You have to go and sign up and register yourself. You have to cook for yourself and you have to do your own laundry and all of these sort of adulting things that were kind of put on hold when I was 16 and 17. It's a different way of life, but then when you realize that everybody around you is sort of in the same boat, it does feel a little more comforting. In terms of the workload, um, university work is really different to school work. Like, first of all, there is a lot of support available. Like, they all know that you're new and you can always drop in and see your tutor in the drop-in hours. My little room back in halls, it's so cute. Like, I was able to customize it myself. I brought all of my photos, I brought my bun, I got my posters like it's just it's my space like it's a really good place to come home to after a cold day of lectures I live in self catered halls so I don't have a great long corridor of people with different doors poking out I actually live in a block of flats and that I personally find really great because it made it a lot easier for me to make friends with the people I live with and I've made some amazing friends like we've had so much fun we've had communal breakfast together we've gone on nights out together like it's just really great living in self-catered halls. Another part of uni life that I really wasn't expecting to be so vibrant was the societies. Everybody there is really passionate and enthusiastic about whatever you're doing. Like, it's not like there's a society that's uncool or a society that's weird because everybody wants to do it. Everybody is genuinely so passionate about it, be it politics or music or activism, literally anything. There are also societies for the course that you're on as well. So it's really easy to get to know people on your course as well, because aside from lectures, you might not think you'd see people a lot, but like I'm with the philosophy society and the classic society. So they always organize like nights out and things where you can just meet up and socialize. You don't have to join up at Freshers. You can join up to a society whenever you like. Probably the best thing about uni life at the moment. Overall, I think that it's been a really successful term at uni I would actually rate it as one of the most exciting and craziest three months that I've ever had I've met new people I forged new friendships I've opened my mind to new things with the societies that I've joined I'm actually oddly excited for adult life to begin instead of thinking oh I want to go home and stay home it's more like I can't wait to get back to uni because I can't wait to keep things going and I can't wait to see what else 2016 is gonna bring. I hope you enjoyed that vlog and hopefully you'll be seeing more stuff from me in the new year. Bye!